Hey YouTubers, it's Tony with Mayberry Mini Truck. Today is April the 18th, 2023, and this is a video <clears throat> of a Subaru Sambar for Jake in Indiana. The um, Subaru is a 1995 4x4 five speed with extra low first gear, and it has 20,327 miles. And uh, pretty, pretty pleased with that kind of mileage. And it's a, it's a pretty truck. So let's go ahead. This was also in a previous video that I did, but this is a more intensive video. You can see here the roof looks nice. And coming down, looks very good on the door. Actually, um, let me get the front. You do have um, a little dent right there. And around the perimeter of the windshield, it does look good. Very clean on the front. It does have a little ding right there. Coming up the pillar, it looks nice. Just fingerprints is all this stuff is here and fingerprints scratch right there. And it uh, looks good here, but it does have a scratch right there. Boy, this bedside looks super nice. Very, very good condition. Nice tires too. Nice wheels, aluminum rims, pretty tires. And it looks good under here. Yep. Let's look underneath the bed. Wow, that looks very, very nice. Look how clean that is. Beautiful. That's your uh, antifreeze overflow tank there. Beautiful. Okay. So the bedside looks great. Also, again, the tires and wheels are very nice. The tailgate looks really good. It's just got one little ding on it, right? Yeah. The inside of the bed looks very good. Uh, it's just got some scuffs where the paint got scuffed. Um, it does have an impression. Right there, and a, another impression right there, and then here, your bedside does have a a dent right there, and a scuff there and there that has been touched up. The bed. Again, I didn't really show you this part, but that does look nice. The back of the cab is just scuffed, but really nice. So let me show you this door. <clears throat> the door is just dirty. That is just dirt. That's not a scratch. That's dirt there. So yeah, this door looks really nice. Okay, let's take it for a drive. Oh, actually, let's look at the interior first. Door panel looks very nice. Underneath the door. Beautiful. Nice, nice, nice. That's what you want to see right there. The seat has a split and just a little bird's mouth right there. But it's very, very pretty inside. Just beautiful. Very, very nice. I remember this battery cover was stuck to the seat. Uh, in my other video, it was kind of like, 
but it's just some sort of adhesive that was on the battery cover. It's nothing. Uh, all right, well, let's go ahead and start it. Fires right up, runs re really well. Wow. That's a lot of. Stuff in there. Toolkit. Nice Subaru toolkit. So, this is trash that somebody put in there. I'm not going to let it blow around on our test drive, but just put that back in there. Um, oh, I don't know. Let's see. Yep. Oh, good. Okay. All right. So, here we go. Let's drive this fresh little. Subaru sandbar and see how it does. Now I'm in two wheel drive, which is very important. Nice tight turn. And go from first gear to third gear because I'm going downhill as it is. So it's pretty easy to coax the truck into acceleration all you have to do is wait patiently and it will accelerate down the hill so going from first to third to fifth is not a big deal going up the hill different story you have to do it the right way or i'm really getting on it <laughs> I don't know if that shows in the video, but I'm, uh, Well, my camera is not being cooperative, so I'm just going to try to limp back. It's my gimbal. My gimbal is not really cooperating. All right, we'll try that. There we go. Actually, that's better. Okay. I inadvertently fixed it. So, here we go. Now we're going to go up the hill. We went down a pretty steep hill. Yeah, it's running well. Uh, the, the gimbal's working. So, um, now we're in fourth gear. And this thing has great power. I can tell right away. So, now we're going to fifth gear. So there's fifth. And we're just climbing the hill nicely maybe even accelerating a little bit. Yeah, we are. We're accelerating in fifth gear up this hill. Now we're in fourth gear. And you can see the speedometer and the road at the same time. I'm going to get it into fifth gear. Now we're in fifth again. And it's holding its speed, even increasing in speed, up this hill in fifth gear. So that's a good sign. And it is an extremely low mileage truck, which, you know, means 
it has good compression. So uh, there is the conclusion of our test drive, our Subaru Sambar with nice low miles, good looking truck. And um, if you are uh, interested in this truck, uh, right now this video is for Jake. Um, the vehicle is um, $8,400. And uh, he has first right of refusal. So if he wants to buy it, it'll be available for him. If he doesn't want to, uh, to buy it, then it will be available for sale. The truck will be serviced with full synthetic 5W30 engine oil and new air filter, new oil filter. We check all the fluids and um, we make sure that it drives properly. Um, we take trucks to our mechanics all the time. Uh, you know, make, getting them dialed in and um, making sure that the four wheel drive works, making sure that it runs properly when it reaches normal operating temperature and <clears throat> also making sure that the heat works uh, and um, making sure that, um, you know, um, that, um, you know, all the fluids are correct. We check the front diff, the rear diff, the transfer case, the transmission, the antifreeze and the radiator, the brake fluid, and we make sure that the charging system operates properly. Um, and then we make it available for sale. And we got the law passed in North Carolina making mini trucks street legal. So we'll also give you a title. And that's all included in the price. We don't charge anything extra. If it says this truck is, you know, $8,400, that's all you pay, unless you want to buy air filters, which would not be a bad idea uh, because you cannot get those locally. Um, however, you can, uh, and they're $20 a piece, which uh, isn't, isn't a lot for the air filter. But um, uh, the oil filter, you can get at Napa or Advance Auto. Hmm. I think that about does it. I uh, would like to ask if you would please subscribe to our channel. That would help our search analytics. And also uh, hit the notification bell and then you can get notified when I post a new video. And uh, I appreciate you watching my video.